Morning, Morning. That's Tito Rodel. TMCR, Mount Faber, Pepys Road, and Sentosa. So you'll be doing the tourist um, areas of Singapore as a cyclist. Yeah, thank you, Jad, for bringing us here. That's Tito Rodel. Okay. Okay, so yung first part natin is let's just invest time to allow Tito Rodel to adapt dito sa Singapore kasi as you know, Singapore is baliktad sa kalsada ng Philippines. So, I'm just allowing him and letting him feel the road first para later, uh, mas mabil niya yung confidence niya. By the way, Tito Rodel is not using his bike, so big thanks to Omar of CRC Singapore and Coach Lian uh, kasi ito yung bike ni Coach na nasa Singapore that CRZ members can actually use whenever they are here so you don't have to worry about bringing your bikes kasi as long as you have the same height as me and Coach Lian you can borrow this bike joke lang kamusta? subukan natin na just sa sana yung tool na dala ko sa match dyan silipin ko lang okay good morning uh, Tito Rodel hi hi um Start na kami mag-ride, nandito kami sa Boat Key. So, dito yung starting point namin. Hi! Punta na kami ng Tanamera Coastal, mga 30 kilometers from here yan. Maga pa yung mata ko. <laughs> okay, so, later let. So, basically, yung first part ng ride natin is uh, start tayo sa Boat Key. Boat Key is uh, basically a strip which is an entry point papunta ng Clark Key. This is where mostly of the tourists are. Dito kasi yung mga kainan. And that's Tito Rodel sa harap ko. So we decide to just take the uh, park connector muna para slowly Tito Rodel can adapt sa road condition ng Singapore. And then later when we uh, reach the partial part of East Coast is uh, babalik na kami sa road. So this is a, uh, a, a very basic way to just introduce the roads of Singapore sa mga tourists or foreigns. Uh, Tito Rodel, uh, go left. Yes. This is Marina Bay Sands area and Tito Rodel. Ayan siya. So a quick trivia, itong kalsada na dinadaanan namin today is basically the F1 circuit. Kaya ganyan yung itsura niya. So, basically, after that helix bridge yung nakikita niyo na parang stainless sa harap is tatawid kami dyan sa river. And then, our next destination is um, East Coast Park na. Pero before that, we'll go to Marina um, Gardens by the Bay. Medyo akit tayo dito, Tito Rodel. Pero I think we can... Hindi, akit na lang natin yung bike. Ha? Akit natin yung bike, tara. So, uh -uh. Ito yung Helix Bridge. Uh, very popular sa mga tourists to. So... Kaya wala siyang tao ngayon kasi maaga pa pero later today. Puno na to. Very uh, Instagram area. Instagram worthy area kasi andyan lahat ng view na Singapore. Eh. Basically Singapore in a nutshell is nandito. So after the Silix Bridge punta tayo sa left side which is Gardens by the Bay. Tapos literally tatawid tayo ng dagat. Uh, para pupunta tayo sa park connector ng East Coast. So left tayo dito, Tito Rodel. Hi, so welcome to Gardens by the Bay.
Yan yung bridge na tatawid tayo sa dagat. It's very short. Pero yung ilalim ng bridge na yan is actually a tunnel. Yan yung kalsada sa ilalim. Para siyang highway sa baba. Pero nasa baba ng tubig yun. Yan siya. So, ito yung bridge uh, sa Marina Barrage. Uh, and the one on the left is yan yung fresh water. And the one on the right is yan yung salt. It's a very, you know, short bridge lang pero maganda siya. Yeah. And this is a nice view para makita mo yung city view ng Singapore from here. Marina Bay Sands, Gardens by the Bay, and then that's Raffles City. So, ito na yung transition natin from city to East Coast Park. So, ito na yung ano niya. Basically, uh, wala na tayo sa city. Uh, so, ito na yung tinatawag nilang East Coast Park. So, ito na yung start ng East Coast Park. Um, all the way na to sa, ano, sa airport. So, for the next 15 kilometers, um, airport na yung bound natin. Pero at the same time, hindi tayo dadaan sa main road ng airport. Sa gilid tayo. So, makikita mo yung airport from the likod. Mostly yung mga newbie bikers, runners, dito sila nag-start talaga. Like myself. Um, ito yung uh, current destination namin ni Tito Rodel. Uh, this is one alternate way na daanan papunta sa Tanamera Coastal kasi connected to sa airport all the way from the city to the airport so this is going to be a 15 kilometers right na puro greenery and then later in between merong mga dagat sa side Yung sinabi ko kanina, ito yung part ng East Coast uh, area na maganda yung view kasi dagat siya. So, other than yung greenery sa left side, uh, meron kang view ng dagat sa right side. So, imagine for the next 15 kilometers, ito yung nakikita mo, di ba? So, kung stress ka sa buhay mo, <laughs> ito yung sagot sa problema mo <laughs> ganda ng ano view merong mga araw na malakas yung May days na malakas yung alon dyan. Pumapalo dyan sa uh, barricade na yan. Mga shipping, ano yan eh. Marami. Mababaw, Mababaw na o. Oh. Ito yung um, dulo ng East Coast Park. Which is, tawag nila dito is NSRCC, I think. Um, then, ayun yung beach. And si Tito Rodel. Uh, kakatapos lang niya ng I think 15 or 20 kilometers from the city so from here, eto na yung start natin palabas dito, right side tayo yan yung tinatawag na Tanamera Coastal uh, it's a 12 kilometer stretch so yan yung place for workout, for time trial uh, basically it's just a straight road uh, 5 lanes or 4 lanes parang autobahn mm. so Hopefully, mahina yung crosswind and front, uh, no, no, headwind. So, after 12 kilometers, U-turn tayo. And then, babalik tayo dito. Ang next destination natin is um, Sentosa. Okay, let's go. Morning. Okay, so 20 kilometers na yung natapos namin. And, uh, papasok na kami ng Tanamera Coastal. 
So, ito yung 12 kilometers and then you turn tayo. Tapos balik tayo ulit dito para balik tayo sa city. I'm sorry. Okay, so dito na tayo sa Singapore bike update. Uh, currently nasa Panamera Coast talaga kami. So, ito yung Silex equivalent. Um, basically, it's 12 kilometers tapos you turn na kami. So, Chris, akong bahala sa dati nyo. Okay. And uh, currently, <clears throat> so this is uh, KMCR. That's the Trotel. So, ito yung first lap namin. And uh, it is uh, 12 kilometers long stretch of non-stop. So, this is the uh, bike path. And ito yung para sa cars. Enjoy. Hello, coach. You gonna get coach? <laughs> Thank you for letting you your bike. Okay. Um, and finally, tapos na yung first U-turn namin. Uh, balik na kami sa city ulit. This is after 12 kilometers. So, let's hear it from the tourist. Anong masasabi mo, Tito Rodel, from East Coast Park? I mean, From city, East Coast Park, Tanamera Coastal. So, in America Coastal pala, uh, parang outskirt, sabi nga ni Jad, no? So, hindi ganun kasulik daw dito. Uh, unlike doon, sa, ano, sa um, uh, center na Singapore. Medyo center sa uh -oh. kanya. So, How can you compare yung experience ng first time na sa Singapore and Philippines? Wow, first time cycling sa Singapore. Uh, thank you, Jad, uh, Jeng, and the kids. Huh? We have also together last night, uh, Maggie, uh, our youngest. And thank you for that big ring. <laughs> thank you, Coach. 56. So without that, Jad, grabe to. Very consistent with that. Takbo mo yata mga 40 plus so, <laughs> Hindi pinitawan yung kilometro yun Hindi mo tandaan <laughs> So this is 12 kilometer stretch uh -oh. Just like in maybe in Germany they call it uh, Autobahn Autobahn No speed limit <laughs> uh, Wind is so you know, yeah. Masyado malakas ang hangin no? so, Oo oh, may headwind eh may headwind, no? So again thank you It's a nice experience in Singapore Cycling with Jad So punta kayo dito Let's go Okay sige Bye for now Bye for now Bye for now Bye for now Punan kita sa harap. Punta ka ng konti sa harap dito na din. Yan. Nice. Okay. So, pa-U-turn na kami sa City ulit. So, basically, from Tanamera, uh, 12 kilometers tayo ulit. Tapos, East Coast Park, additional 10. And then, after that, Mount Faber. That's probably additional 5 kilometers pabalik. So right after the city ride and uh, nature ride and then autobahn babalik naman tayo ngayon sa climbing para in one shot my experience ni uh, Tito Rodel ang uh, Singapore cycling Kakatapos lang namin sa TMCR naka 24 na kami and uh, re-entering eh, East Coast Park so ayan na si Dan Tito Rodel Dan Silex, Singapore yeah. So na-survive niya yung TMCR Under this hot weather So back na kami sa Park ulit uh, To recover And then city Then climbs kami sa Faber Okay, so Kung part kayo ng CRC community Never hesitate to let us know Uh, pwede namin kayong e-tour sa Singapore Let's go Singapore! Okay. Let's go Singapore! 
Tara, kita kita sulit mamaya Okay So, part 1 ng ride Tapos na ah, Lilipat na kami ni Tito Rodel Sa Main Street Ayan yung mga ibang riders So, Main Street It means ito yung first time ni, ni Tito Rodel na Lalabas sa actual road ng Singapore Wherein uh, Magmi-mix up na kami sa mga cars uh, It sounds normal Pero the only tricky part is As I mentioned a while ago Balik na dandaan ng Singapore So Good luck Tito Rodel Thank you Keep safe yeah. Okay In few meters Labas na tayo diba? Diretso lang So nakabalik na kami sa city uh, And that's Tito Rodel approaching the uh, Fullerton Bridge Or Fullerton area So after this uh, We will just go straight for a few And then uh, ito na yung road Papunta sa Mount Faber We decided to uh, Actually not decided I just surprised Tito Rodel So we're currently in West Coast Highway It's uh, around 5-6 kilometer stretch So riding here feels like you're riding in Viaduct and Lex Okay So on the way to Faber That's Tito Rodel in front of me And that's the view Tito Rodel after 70 plus kilometers uh, you will be doing the first climb two climbs to so first is uh, Pepe's Road and then we descend tapos we go back to the street tapos Mount Faber so briefing tayo dun sa baba first time ko nakita to so this one provides us a bit of information about Pepe's Road it says World War II Interpretative Center uh, basically, ito yung road namin, Pepe's Road. Ayan yung mga turns niya. And that is a climb. It's a very short climb. Pero for a beginner, for a first timer, it would be uh, interesting. So that's the start. 54. 54. Okay. Tapos, uh, 11 speed. Salamat daw, coach. Kasi nakaman pa si Tito Rodel ngayon. Ang mangyayari sa akin dito. Coach. So, hello guys. Bali, na 75 kilometers na si Tito Rodel. Ang next challenge niya uh, as part of this Singapore uh, riding adventure niya is after the time trial kanina sa TMCR is magka-climb siya ng twice. Uh, first is uh, Pepe's Road, which is this. And then the second is Mount Faber. Pero ang challenge natin is I am not going to give Tito Rodel an idea how challenging this climb is. So, applied biomechanics lang gagawin natin. Marami na akong absent eh. Mga ano yan? Kayang-kaya. Marami na akong absent eh. Sorry ko, pag hindi sa kali ha. Marami na akong absent eh. Yaka-yaka. Let's go. Anyway. Sige Pwede ko ano muna mga few minutes <laughs> Oh sige Oh sige Nanginginam few minutes ha <laughs> Paano naman yan? Turo mo nga yan Paano naman to? Kaya yung few minutes yan Tignan mo <laughs> Wala akong option Ang option ko eh Dapat di ako mag stone <laughs> Ang option mo lang Either pumadyak o pumaba <laughs> Wala siya smalling <laughs> Sige Tignan natin <laughs> Just go straight lang dito na din. Uh, the first, uh, the first climb, sundan mo lang yung line to, to the right. 
Yeah. Yeah. And uh, this is Tito Rodel's first time climbing Pepe's Road, Singapore on 54 chain ring. <laughs> Wala siyang small ring, just to let you know guys. <laughs> so, let's just climb it slowly as, well, as much as we can para hindi tayo maubos. May gli lang to. This is Tito Rodel Singapore certification. <laughs> yeah, sundal lang yan. I think may isa ka pa. May isa pa yata. Ayan yan. Hi. Yakan nga. Ito yung unang ano niya, curve niya. So, exciting to mamayang pababa. Ah, uh, slowly lang dyan. <clears throat> slowly. So, what makes this very interesting is Tito Rodel is climbing it for the first time. At hindi ko siya binigyan ng idea about this climb. nasa first two climbs and that would be the, the last <sighs> that's gonna be the last one yung first two is like around 8-9% graded okay big car this is this way okay derecho derecho Almost done. That's it. Summit is there. Okay, 10 meters away. Okay. Woo. Now we're doing it five times, huh? Woo. <laughs> Woo. Aye, so that's Tito Rodel completing Pepe's road. And on 54 feet, no small ring. Thank you, coach. Yeah. Thank you, Jed. So, actually, you're the first uh, CRZ na nag Pepe's Road. Oh. Yeah, even certification di pa ginamit to ni coach. Even coach hindi pa niya na try to. So you're the first. Oh. <laughs> Steve. Yeah, so Thank coach. Uh, this is something you might want to consider. Ano masasabi mo dito, Rodel? Palagi ako salamat sa mga ano basics. Yeah. Every time. Works all the time. Tama. So come on. Make like the certification. Na? Ang galing no Thank kasi you. First time mo Thank dito. Thank you. mo agad. It's really hard. But, uh, uh, part of the process. As cost says. Coach uh, Lian said. Galing. Thank you. Hi. Hi, so Singapore. Thank you. We're not done yet. Gusto pang sumampan ni Tito Rodel ng five times. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Sabi niya, Coach, 60 tapos na kami. Ngayon, 80 kilometers, kinapakit pa ako. Kung ano ako din na ito, gaming budol. Skyway kami, mayroon kami ng airport, time trial, pinabol namin yung mga puti. Grabe, nakas ni Jed. Congratulations, Jed. Ang galag. Iba na kala ko nga, si coach ka na eh, pag nakatalikot ka eh. Mas pogi ako din. Hi, let's go. Hi, so, descent na kami eh. And then Mount Faber tayo. Oh. Yeah, Mount Faber is more manageable. Uh, kasi ito, yung interesting part dito is, is it is short pero it's stiff. Mount Faber is a bit longer pero medyo okay yung incline niya. Okay, so this is Tito Rodel, Singapore certification. <laughs> Thank you, God bless everyone. Hi. Hi.
Oh, pwede na yan. Bali sa left side ka, dito Rodel. Balik na lang daan eh. Sasalubungin ka nila dyan. O oh, yan, pababa na kami. So, kakatapos lang ni Tito Rodel sa Pepe's Climb on a 50-40 chain ring. And uh, this is Pepe's Road. So, after namin bumaba, uh, we go back to the uh, street, then we go to Mount Faber for the next climb. So that's Tito Rodel and uh, ito na yung final climb namin which is Mount Faber but before that we pop by Siklo Cafe which is a uh, CRZ partner in Singapore so after the climb we'll go back for a uh, good coffee off to our final climb buti na lang maganda yung panahon no? so same approach I'm not gonna give you any idea pero nagkaroon ka ng idea kay Pepe's so this one is slightly more interesting and still 54 chain first time to climb and uh, still climbing after 80 plus kilometers okay. so see you in a few pag sampan namin sa taas good luck so this is Pender Road ito yung first part ng Mount Faber um, first time ni Tito Rodel dito and first part is only a good 2 3, 4% gradient ah, tapos ganyan sya kahaba and ayan ang view ni Tito Rodel from the first part of Faber So, ito yung second part ng climb which is the uh, 7 to 9% gradient. From here, papunta doon sa left. Tito Rodel, try mo mag move forward 90 degrees tip of the saddle para mas madali siyang akitin. Okay, to our third part of the climb that's the uh, 10 to 11 percent gradient slow down natin turtle mahaba yan and it's titerdel's first time to climb this so imagine on a 54 feet chain ring so wala siyang choice No excuses no Tito Rodel No excuse Go Let's go Done with that 10% Now 4th, 5th and 6th climb On the way Recover lang dyan Tapos Sampa ulit The next climb.
That's the final climb. Five, four, three, two, go. Time after time, I've done my sentence, but committed no crime and bad mistakes. Yeah. To the right. I've made a few. I've had my sham set get to my base, but I. So let's favorite part. After how many kilometers? 83. What time did we start it? 7.30. Yeah. So we started 7.30 around now that. Now it's 12.30. 12.30. Very productive. Because what we did is from 7.30, we started from City Hall, City. Then we went to Marina Bay Sands, Gardens by the Bay, and then East Coast Park. That was followed by TMCR, which is uh, a 12, 24 kilometers. TMCR is a time trial. Then after that, we went back to the city. Uh, we did climbs. So starting with Pepe's Road and then Mount Faber. 60 years old plus. Thank you. Doing all the certification <laughs> route in Let's just go. one day. Let's go. <laughs> no reason. No reason. <laughs> no reason at all. Let's go. Okay. So, yeah, that's Citro Del. In the next 10, 15, 20 years from now, hopefully this adventure in Singapore is going to remind him of yes, his thank you. Thank you. Uh, memories. Yeah. Thank you for your memories. Yeah. Thank you. Cool. Okay, that wrap, wraps up up our ride today. No more Sentosa because it's hot. Yeah. Uh, but at least there's something we can try next time. Yeah. Thank you, Titrodel. Thank you very uh, much, Jan. I really, I really appreciate you to be there to us yeah. here in Singapore, even few days. Salamat. God bless. See you soon. Bye. Bye. Okay, tapos sa rito mo. You can overtake me.
left, left, left. Go to the coffee shop. You can go to the coffee shop now. Sigilan niya yung momento na. Okay, we're back to our... Um, I think I'll take ice for now. Yeah. Okay, we're back to our base camp. Base camp. Ciclo. Ciclo so, coffee. Good day today, right? Alright. Okay, cool. Hey, good morning, guys. Uh, the Filipino cycling comedy. Yeah. Uh, if you happen to be in Singapore, and passing by Pasir Panjang or Tolublanga, we are the food of Mount Faber. We are Chikoi Cafe. This is our second outlet. And our first outlet, as most of uh, you guys will know, is in Changi Village. So, TM Sira is the way. If you head down uh, over that side, that's our first outlet. So, what we offer coffee, uh, pastry, and all. And if you happen to be here, please drop by. Thank you. Cheers. Okay. Thank you.